Hey everyone, this is Kasia. I'm feeling artsy and today we're gonna draw a rose. Last time we draw a bud and this time we're gonna draw a full blooming rose. I found this picture on the internet and printed it. And to complete this project you will need a piece of paper and a pencil. And then if you wanna color your rose, you also need something to color it with. We will begin by drawing a little outline for what we wanna do here. And I'm going to draw a swirly line that's going to follow this. So first I'm going to do a swirl like this. Actually, let me mark this with a marker so you see what I'm doing. So first I'm going to draw a swirl. Okay. And if you're drawing a real rose from nature, you can just imagine that swirl on top of it. Once we have this, we are going to draw the outline of where everything else is. So I'm going to draw a big shape that goes around my swirl. And it's a rough sketch of where everything will fall. Okay, once we have this, we can start filling in the details. So inside this piece, we have a little shape that's right here. And around this, we have some little petals that I'm gonna draw right now. And then here, we have this petal. So pretty much what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw one petal at a time. Now here. And then right around this, we have this shape. And I'm going to start filling in the dark shapes with my pencil. If you're coloring, don't do it. You'll just do it with a color later. Now this is a little wavy here. But inside of here we have this. So we're going to draw that now. Now this goes in here like this. And I'm going to do this petal next. So pretty much what I'm doing is I'm studying each of these shapes and then I'm drawing them this. Now I'm moving on to the outer petals. Okay, I feel like my rough sketch is pretty good. If you are coloring, I would switch to your um, coloring tools right now. So whether it's colored pencils or markers or just <coughs> crayons. Otherwise, um, if you want to do what I'm doing, I'm going to do a bunch of shading with my pencil. 
So I'm gonna go in and all these spaces that are really dark in the picture and I will darken them here. And that will give our rose a more three-dimensional look. You see, you can do this for a very long time and keep adding more and more details. I'm gonna go ahead and um, add some leaves here, I think. Uh, over here on the side, I'm gonna add a leaf. I'm gonna start with the stem. And then add a big leaf like this. And the rose leaves have these ridges, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna add them here. I'm also going to come in with my eraser and erase some of these lines I no longer need here to make it look cleaner. Okay, I think my rose sketch is done. Make sure to give me a thumbs up and um, subscribe and come back to see me soon. I'm going to sign my picture and date it. And voila!